Hi Cancers and welcome my name is Inez and today I'm doing your weekly love reading from February 9th through the 15th. <clears throat> Please keep in mind that these are general love readings so it cannot or will not resonate with all of you. So if it doesn't apply then what are you going to do? That's right you're going to let it fly and if it does apply I would love to read your comments down below. Also, if you would like to get a personal reading, you can contact me at intimategoddesstarot at gmail.com. Okay? Well, let's get your reading started, Kansas. Let's get this started now. Mm, 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 mm. Let's find out. Please tell me about Cancers in love from February 9th through the 15th, 2020. Please tell me about Cancers in love from February 9th. Through the 15, 2020. Please tell me about Cancers in Love from February 9th through the 15, 2020. Please tell me about Cancers in Love from February 9th through the 15, 2020. Please tell me about Cancers in Love from February 9th through the 15, 2020. Please tell me about Cancers in Love from February 9th through the 15, 2020. Here we go. Please tell me about Cancers in Love from February 9th to the 15th, 2020. Please tell me about Cancers in Love February 9th to the 15th, 2020. Please tell me about Cancers in Love from February 9th to the 15th, 2020. Please tell me about Cancers in Love from February 9th to the 15th, 2020. Please tell me about Cancers in Love from February 9th to the 15th, 2020. This one came out first, and that one flew out afterwards. Please tell me about Cancers in Love from February 9th to the 15th, 2020. Please tell me about Cancers in Love from February 9th to the 15th, 2020. Please tell me about Cancers in Love. Okay, at the bottom of the deck, we have the Queen of Cups. We got the Queen of Cups, Cancer. What we got here? Oh, I don't know if you guys seen it, but I got a new background here. Yes, it's a new background. You guys gonna like it? I got it last week. When did it come in? Friday. Yeah, it came in on Friday. I don't think I think I already did your video, so you guys didn't get to see it. Cause I know Capricorn got to see it, and. A few other signs got to see it, but this is my new background. You guys like it? It's new. I'm excited. It's nice. I got it off of Amazon. <laughs> so, anyways, back to you, Kanta. Let's see. So, we have here the High Priestess and the Three of Pentacles. We have the Queen of Swords and a Magician. And we have the Four of Pentacles and the Page of Wands. There. Yeah. So, I got my background here. Because, you know, I have my sister that's a Capricorn. She kept telling me, you need to get a background. You need to get yourself a background and everything. Because I work in compliance, and so I know. It. And I'm like, well, I work in credentialing, so I know too. Okay, I got my background now. Like, whatever. I already knew how to get a background. Whatever. But I got my background. I keep jumping right back to me, right? First start off with cancer, then right back to me. <laughs> I guess I want to be center of attention today. I guess so. But anyways, let's do your reading because you came here to listen to your reading, not me. Well, actually, yeah, you did. But let's get let's get your reading started. So right here, what I'm seeing here is that you guys are not communicating with somebody. You want to cooperate with this person. They want to cooperate with you. But you guys are not in communication. You guys could be dealing with an air sign. You guys could be dealing with a Pisces or a fire sign. You could be dealing with a, an Aquarius as well. 
uh, you could be dealing with a Capricorn Taurus Virgo or you could be dealing with a Gemini Libra Aquarius we also have fire here so you guys are not communicating with this person at all although somebody here does want to communicate because they want to they're trying to manifest you back this person trying to manifest you back or you trying to manifest this person back because you want to communicate and with the Queen of Swords here the Queen of Swords, she speaks her truth. She's cutthroat. She says what she has to say. And she's very direct about it. But this person wants to manifest you because they want to talk to you. And they're going to be honest with you because that's the way the Queen of Swords is. She tells you the truth. She tells you how it is. And But somebody's still holding back. Somebody's holding back. They're not opening up. Although they want to communicate with you because we got the Page of Wands here. So they want to contact you and the Page of Wands brings good news. And that's also flirtatious energy. So let's see what's going on here. Let's start clarifying this. Okay. Julissa. Please give me more information on the high priestess. Please give me more information on the high priestess. Please give me more information on the high priestess. Please give me more information on the high priestess. Please give me. Okay, okay. Somebody wants to. We got the Knight of Cups. We got the Page of Pentacles. And we have the Seven of Wands. So somebody wants to come back in. There's an apology here. I see an apology here. Someone making an offering. Someone's here making an offering. They're making an apology as well. And they want to fight for this. Because you guys are not talking right now. There's no communication going on between the both of you guys. You guys are not talking. And this person now, they want to stop fighting this. They want to stop fighting, not communicating with you, basically. Because you guys are not talking. So, And they want to come towards you. They want to make an offer. And, they want to make, and they're also going to apologize. Because the Page of Pentacles, I see that as an apology as well. Not just as an offering or a message. I see it as an apology. Let me find out. Let me get one more on the High Priestess. Please give me more information on the High Priestess. Please give me more information on the High Priestess. There we go. See? Excuse me. We have the Ace of Cups. They want to stop fighting that feeling. They're going to stop fighting that feeling. They want to come towards you. This person wants to come towards you. They want to apologize. They want to make an offering. And they're going to stop fighting the feeling knowing that they do love you. And they want a new beginning with you. But they're busy over there trying to fight the funk. Don't try to fight it. If you know you love a person, they just go towards it. I'm like, shit, the worst they can do is tell you no, right? Let's find out about the Three of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Three of Pentacles. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? Please get more information that did not want to come out. Please get more information on the Three of Pentacles. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? Please get more information on the Three of Pentacles. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? Please get more information on the Three of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Three of Pentacles. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? Please give more information on the Three of Pentacles. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? Please give more information on the Three of Pentacles. Please give more information on the Three of Pentacles. Please give more information on the Three of Pentacles. Please give more information on the Three of Pentacles. There we go. What we have here. Patience is a virtue. Okay. So this person now wants to cooperate. So we have temperance. Equal give and take. Now, the temperance is clarifying the three of pentacles, which is cooperating, meeting you halfway. You know, be you guys being on the same the same page. A equal give and take. That's why you have the cups that she's pouring in from one cup to another. Equal give and take. And this is also going to require um, patience. We have the ten of cups here. Meeting each other. And then we have... The Ten of Wands in reverse. So this person is releasing all burdens. Whatever burdens this person had or if they were stressed out or if they was overwhelmed. 
or just taking on other people's burden. They're releasing all that. They're releasing it. Now they are willing to cooperate with you. They're willing to meet you halfway. And they want it to be an equal give and take. And this is also going to require patience from you. Because it's not going to happen overnight. So patience is going to be required. And your relationship is going to need to be healed. Healing needs to take place. Patience. And once you guys accomplish that, then you guys can have everything else. You can have your ton of cups. You can have that new beginning, but you're going to need patience here. And you're going to need to heal. Both of you guys are going to need to heal. Let's find out about this Queen of Swords. Please get more information on the Queen of Swords. Why is this Queen of Swords here? Please get more information on the Queen of Swords. Please give me more information on the Queen of Swords. Why is this Queen of Swords here? Please give me more information on the Queen of Swords. That's way too many damn cards. Please give me more information on the Queen of Swords. Please give me more information on the Queen of Swords. Please give me more information on the Queen of Swords. Why is the Queen of Swords here? Please get more information on the Queen of Swords. Please get more information on the Queen of Swords. All these cards keep coming out. You guys don't know how to just do one. Okay, well, I'm going to go right ahead and take it. Because every single one of these flipped up right. I'm going to go right ahead and take it. We have the Eight of Cups. We have the Queen of Pentacles. You guys could be dealing with an Earth sign. Uh, Virgo. And the Empress. New beginnings. So we also have the Six of Pentacles in reverse. So things were in balance between the both of you guys. Somebody here wants to communicate with you guys. They want to communicate with you and they're coming back. This person is coming back because we got the Eight of Cups in reverse. And they're coming back and this person that's coming back, they, they're off. This person is. They're coming back because they want stability with you. This person is also someone that's, uh, that's confident, that's stable. This person is confident, they're stable, they know their worth. And they're coming back because this person wants a new beginning with you. They want stability with you. They're offering you stability. They want a new beginning. They want expansion. They want growth. And they want to come back and talk to you. They want to come back and talk to you. So they're off. So this person is offering you stability. They're offering you a new beginning. I mean, we have it right here. I mean, the whole entire this so far this whole entire spread is basically saying them coming back, them coming back, them coming back, wanting their ten of cups, new beginning. And let's find out about the magician. Please get more information on the magician. Why is this magician here? Please get more information on the magician. Why is this magician here? Please get more information on the magician. Why is this magician here? Please get more information on the magician. Why is the magician here? Please get more information on the magician. Why is the magician here? Please get more information on the magician. Please get more information on the magician. Why is this magician here? Please get more information on the magician. Please get more information on the magician. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Go ahead, Cancer. Well, we have the King of Wands or the King of Rods. And this person feels very passionate towards you. And look, they're taking action. There's action here. This person's taking with that. Because the king of because the king of wands, he takes, I like to say wands, even though it says rods. I don't know for some reason I don't like the way it sounds rods, so I say wands. Because it flows more better out of my mouth versus rods. I like wands. <laughs> Anyways, the king of wands. He's born ready. He doesn't get ready. And when he wants something, he goes after it. He takes action. And this king takes action. And this king feels very passionate about you. And who the hell? She got me sick. Oh, okay. That was a text. My bad, Cancers. 
And we have the Ace of Wands here. This is them taking action, communicating with you, wanting a new passionate beginning with you. Look what we got here. Four of Wands. They want that commitment with you. Why? Because they're missing you. Five of Cups here. This person is missing you. They're busy crying over you, Cancer. They're crying over you because they miss you. They miss touching you. They miss feeling you. They miss kissing you. They feel miss holding you, holding you. You know what I'm trying to say. But either way, this person is missing you. And they want a new beginning. This person wants a new beginning. And look, at the bottom of the deck, we have the Seven of Swords in reverse. So if there was any type of lying, cheating, uh, uh, self-sabotaging the whole entire situation, you know, sabotaging the whole entire relationship, or negative thinking, you know, negative self-talk, this person is going to come clean. They're going to tell you. With the Seven of Swords here in reverse, this person is going to come clean and they're going to tell you. Because remember, we have the Queen of Swords here. And the Queen of Swords, she speaks truth. Okay, so she, she speaks truth and she takes action on truth. So this person is going to be, they're going to tell you the truth if there was any type of lying or cheating going on. But either way, the point is, this person is missing you, Cancer. Yes, they are missing you and they're going to take action because they're manifesting you back into their life. So if you're not ready, you better get ready. Okay? So get ready because this person is manifesting you back into their life. They are going to take action and this person wants commitment. Like I said, this whole entire reading is basically saying they're coming back. They want a new start with you. And look, we have two aces on this. We have two aces here. The ace of cups and the ace of wands. So there's love and passion. So this person feels so this person feels passionate towards you. And they want stability with you. They're offering stability. This person is not this person is not just coming in trying, you know, trying to get some and then leave. You know, be like, thank you, girl. You know, thank you for that booty and shit. That shit felt real good. I like it. Well, you know, we must get together sometime again. No, they ain't coming for that. They coming in to stay because they want commitment. This person wants commitment with you. Because they're missing you. They're missing you. They want to be with you. Let's find out about this four of pentacles. Please get more information on the four of pentacles. Please get more information on the Four of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Four of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Four of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Four of Pentacles. Why is the Four of Pentacles here? Please get more information on the Four of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Four of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Four of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Four of Pentacles. Okay. What we have here on the four of pentacles. Okay, so somebody's hurt. And they want to come out from the cold. So we have the three of swords right here. Somebody's hurt. This is not a three-party situation. Somebody's hurt here. Somebody ended up getting hurt. Somebody got their feelings hurt. I wouldn't go as far as saying that they got their heart broken. But I would say they did get the... Excuse me. I would say that they did get their feelings hurt and they want to come out of the cold because we have the five of pentacles in reverse and this person wants to come out of the cold with you and we have justice here so this person wants to do right by you so whoever this person was this person wasn't opening up to you emotionally or financially and someone ended up getting their feelings hurt but now Things need to be made right. Whatever was wrong, they need to make they need to make it right. Whatever was wrong, they need to make it right. Because this person wants to come out from the cold. Either you guys are already communicating by now with a five of pentacles in reverse. Some of you guys may be communicating already. And this person is, is trying to make things right with you. They're trying to do right by you. So some of you guys may be communicating with this person already. And they could be trying to do they could be trying to do right by you. Because this person got somebody got their feelings hurt here. They could have got their feelings hurt. Yeah, because we also have the page of wands right next to it. So there's communication. Please give me more information on the page of wands. Please give me more information on the page of wands. Please give me more information on the page of wands. 
Give you more information on the page of wands. Give you more information on the page of wands. Give you more information on the page of wands. I knew this card wanted to come out. Oh, it's bound to come out. So we have five of wands, conflict. Look at that. We got another pentacle. I mean, another ace. Ace of pentacles. The three of uh, pentacles. What? Okay, so this person wants to communicate with you because they want to cooperate. They're willing to cooperate now. They want to meet you halfway. They want to, they're willing to compromise because they want a new beginning with you. Stability with you here. But there's conflict. Somebody here is conflicted. Why? Is it you, Cancer? Are you guys the one that's conflicted here? Please get more information on the page of wands. Please get more information on the page of wands. Please get more information on the page of wands. Why is the page of wands here? Please get more information on the page of wands. Please get more information on the page of wands. <coughs> Excuse me. Please get more information on the page of wands. Please get more information on the... Ooh. Oh. So, we have the six of wands here. They're trying to get your attention. Because we have the the ju judgment came out in reverse. It could have, it came out sideways. So I'm going to tell you both ways. Either a second chance, the opportunity was turned down due to conflict. Due to the conflict, a second opportunity could have been turned down. Or... A second opportunity is being granted. A second opportunity is being granted and there's no more conflict. And this person's trying to get your attention here because they want this new star. I mean, because I don't understand why at the end of the day, this person wanting all of this, coming back, communicating towards you, wanting uh, offering you stability wanting a new fresh start because they're in love with you and they want passion new beginning you actually turn around and they're willing to cooperate with you you know meet you halfway you actually turn it i mean but then again it all depends on the situation right because everybody's situation is different so everything's case by case so this is not going to resonate the same with everybody. Some of you guys probably this turned this person down. Because like I said, it came out sideways. So in reverse, some of you guys are turning this person down. Due to all the conflict that had took place between the both of you guys. And it's like, you just can't come back from that. It's too much. I can't. I'm sorry, but you just can't come back from that. You can't just walk in here thinking that I'm going to welcome you with open arms and be like, yeah, I'm going to go right ahead and give you a second chance. No, it doesn't work that way. It's not that easy. Some of you guys are not giving this person a second chance. And some of you guys are giving this person a second chance. You're putting the conflict and you're not letting conflict, you know, interfere in your new beginning. Some of you guys are like, no, it was too much. It was too much conflict. I'm not doing it. And some of you guys are, but this person really wants, this person is taking action. This person is taking action. They are going to communicate with you. So for so some of you guys, some of you guys are communicating already because we did have the five of pentacles in reverse, which some of you guys are already communicating. This person already came out of cold, and some of you guys are not communicating. But this person does want to communicate with you because they they want you, Cancer. This person wants you. They want you, Cancer. They want the second chance. Now, whether you decide to give this person a second chance or not, that's your decision, not mine. I cannot tell you what to do. Like I said, everybody's situation is different. Not everybody's situation is going to be the same. So, it all depends on your situation. If you feel that this person actually deserves a second or third or fourth or fifth time or better yet, tenth time. 
Only you know your story. I don't. So, uh, let's get to a guidance message here. Please give me a guidance message for cancer. Please give me a guidance message for cancer. Please give me a guidance message for cancer. What does this say? Look at that. Patience. No matter what the situation or delay is, your desire will come when it is meant to. And remember, I was telling you, you guys need patience. For those of you guys that are going to take this person, patient back, person, not patient. I keep saying patient. Whoever you guys are that's going to take this person back, we have tempers here. And what I told you is going to require patience from uh, patience from you guys. Patience is going to be required here. You guys are going to have to go through a healing process and patience is going to be needed because it's not like you guys are going to just pick up and just start doing things right away as if nothing happened. No. There's a process that you guys, both of you guys are going to have to go through, which is basically healing the relationship, you know, being patient with each other and meeting each other halfway so, another, so, so this relationship can work. You know, because there is love here. There's love here. So, like I said, patience is virtue. Okay? So, this is all I have for you guys, Cancer. So, you guys be safe. Take care and stay cool. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Bye, Cancers.